Excel GCSE Unit 3, March 2013, Question 22. Here we're asked to prove that two triangles are congruent. We are asked to prove that ABE is congruent to ADG. So what we want to work out is there, are we talking about side two sides and included angle are we talking about three sides and so on so we need to prove one of these theories if we look at the sides that we're talking about we're told that abcd and aefg are both squares so therefore we can start looking at ad and we can say that that is equal to AB on the other triangle because they are squares or they are sides of square. We can also do the same for AG because it's equal to AE. Again, because they are sides of a square. So we now have two sides. We then want to look at the angle because there are no other sides that we can really have a proper comparison because we're left with DG or EB. So if we look at the angle that we're talking about now, we've got, we've already worked out that this side and this side are equal. We've worked out that this side and this side are equal. So now what we're going to look at are the angles in between those two sides. So we're talking about angle EAB being equal to GAD. They are equal and the reason for this is because we have a right angle here, we have a right angle here, and in both cases we are adding the angle EAD to that 90 degrees. So we have 90 degrees in both cases adding on EAD. So we now have the angle. So in this case it is actually side and the included angle. Therefore they are congruent.